<laughs> you weren't lying about setting up a tax center. The key to running a successful black bag operation is plausible deniability. Which is why I stole all this shit from the FBI. <laughs> Things go tits up, those chicken dicks can deal with the fallout. Glad to see you haven't lost your touch. <laughs> if there's one thing I'm good at, it's fucking with Hoover's Ferry Brigade. Ah, oh, damn it! People think living under these commie motherfuckers is so great they should move their asses over to Moscow. You find more of these, you bring them to me. <sighs> so, what's Aldridge doing? But the war! Hmm? He's got a contact huh? in the NBA. Some general is paying big money for his motherfucker! I swear he's the troop! What? Back in 67, we were in a bar in Saigon, and this gook bitch comes strolling in. Skirt barely covering her ass, and she starts offering everybody blowjobs. G.I. wants sucky fucky. Hmm? G.I. wants boom boom. Then she pulls out a grenade and she kills three guys. A couple Marines in the bar want to cut that bitch's head off, but Lincoln stops them. Keeps them off of her until the MPs show up. If he wasn't going to kill that slag, he sure as fuck wasn't going to kill Olivia Marcano. Jesus Christ! I'm gonna shot you in the goddamn face. What's your name? Fernando. La gente me llama. Huh? People call me Chucky. You let people call you Chucky? <laughs> Why would you? You don't forget it. There's a dead man upstairs. Name's Balmana. Yes, so? So the man we're after is the one who shot the living shit out of this place. What's that got to do with me? You're not too bright. Are you, Chucky? Oh, fuck! Oh. You're the sole survivor of a goddamn massacre. That's what it's got to do with you. So, tell us what you heard. All right, all right. Danny, the man who came in here, he was asking about a how. A how? Uh, what house? I, I don't know. Balmana refused to say anything, and then he started screaming. Then he gave him a name. Pedro. Pedro Pong. Say it again so I can hear it. Pedro. Pedro Pong. Jesus Christ. And that was oh! it! He, he, he told another man he was with that they need to get the crew to the plane as quickly as possible. That's everything I hear, all my mother! And to someone like her ain't gonna be easy. Between Marcano's men and all those rich white assholes she runs around with, they'll spot me coming a mile away. I need you to look at our options. Come up with a plan. Okay, I'm gonna look at our options and come up with a plan. What's wrong with you, man? Personal hygiene is very important. <laughs> oh, God damn it, I left my cigarettes back at the restaurant. Look, you need to get yourself some love. Your ass is wound tight. Well, that may be true. The only thing I'm winding my ass is a bullet in that motherfucker's head. Tired of getting sand kicked in your face. <sighs> Gotta do calisthenics three times a week. Keep my heart rate up. You got blood on your shirt. Oh. Ah. Uh, cut myself shaving. Really? Shrimp. What you call me? I Shrimp. have a subscription. You don't wear continental clothes <laughs> or steps and hats. Not wasting any time, are you? Your little rampage is going to attract attention. Attention from people I don't care to associate with. Yeah, imagine not. Thankfully, closing off your loose ends is as simple as tossing around some super grade. <laughs> with any luck, this will keep them off my ass. For a little while, anyway. Motherfucker better still be there. He will be. Has to be. All right, man, enough. We were running all over the goddamn place. It's about time you tell me what went down between you and Aldrich. It's 1963. I'd been in country a little under two years.
I'm Dai Zhang. Chongqing, Shay. Stay out of this, Johnny. That's not exactly my style. Chong's not coming. What did you do? Let's just say Chong had a little accident. Fell down a very deep well. But not before he spilled all your dirty little secrets. Like how you've been feeding intel to the NVA? The U.S. government executes traitors, you know that, right? Fuck you. I'm hoping they'll hang you. But I will settle for a firing squad. Let's go. Juicy to shoot things over with the NVA. So why don't you tell me where those SOG recon teams are heading? <laughs> you really think that I didn't pass on what Tron told me? Right now, every morn in your little circle jerk is being rounded up. I always thought the company was halfway decent at screening out dumbasses. <laughs> Guess I was wrong. Ah, that's funny. That's real funny. <laughs> Before he could go to work on me, a couple MPs showed up. They heard the shot and came running. And Aldridge escaped. He's a slippery little fucker, I'll give him that much. Should have known that Marcano would go to ground at the casino. You can take the bridge up there, so it's a straight shot. You know, none of this would have happened without you. <laughs> it was either this or right away in some goddamn office. And once you've killed those assholes, you come and find me. I'll be hanging around over at the Padres. You got it. You give them hell, champ. Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. Him and Georgie both. Ha! <laughs> it's the best news I've heard in ages. Can we get an amen, Padre? So what happens now? What do you mean, what happens now? It's over. Done. Finished. I ain't talking to you. This city's done gone through enough. It doesn't need another you, Salmon this Cattle. This city? You've got to be fucking kidding me. This city is a cesspool. It's where people come to fuck and drink and get high. You watch your filthy mouth. It's what the city is, Padre. If it's not giving another Sal Marcano, it's going to shit one out. He's right. If it ain't going to be me, it's going to be somebody else. Probably somebody worse. Amen. Thank you. You remember what you told me when you came back from the war? How, how, how you wanted to, to, to go to California? Leave all this behind? And just start all over? Yeah. Bro. Yeah. Well, it ain't too late, Lincoln. You can still go. Go. And don't look back. Listen, I'd love to stay here and debate the merits of one crime boss over another. But I've got a schedule to keep. Bit of advice, though? The scumbags you've been working with, kill them. All of them. Bury them before they bury you, buddy. Oh. I'll be seeing you, Padre. <laughs> you're like... You're like a goddamn cockroach, you know that? <laughs> 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 What the fuck were you thinking? <clears throat> Aiding a sworn enemy of the United States. In wartime, no less. <sighs> NVA are no enemies of mine. <coughs> Same with the VC. 
And that's why he decided to murder thousands of American soldiers with that goddamn nuke? How many soldiers we got scattered around all over there? Most of them are scared shitless. They could give two fucks about any of it. <laughs> they just want to make it home alive. The problem is they get home and their heads are all scrambled. Or maybe they find their girl humping on some fucking asshole who got a deferment for heel spurs. So, you were doing this for the soldiers, is that it? <laughs> and what about the money you were hoping to make? What was that for? <laughs> to ease your conscience? We both took off the talk, it never happened. It's a bunch of bullshit dreamt up by the NSA. You talk to me about killing American soldiers? Brother, the fucking US government's been doing that! <sighs> and for what? God, I used to admire you! Thought you represented everything great about this country! But you are just as greedy and selfish as everyone else! There are no dominoes, Johnny. Vietnam falls. Who gives a shit? It's a fucking backwater. Everybody's living in goddamn huts. And half of them don't even have shoes on their fucking feet, for Christ's sake. At least my way had a chance of ending things. Are you finished? It appears so. something. Senator! Where were you when John Fitzgerald Kennedy was assassinated? I don't remember. At home, I believe. I don't remember. At home, I believe. Let me tell you where I was. A muddy hut in Vietnam. Slowly dismembering an old woman, cutting her apart bit by bit. And do you know why? Because her son was an NVA officer. And hurting her was the only way to make him talk. I don't understand what this has to do... What he told with... us saved the lives of an entire platoon. That's 42 men. Men that lived another day because I was willing to take a saw to that old woman. Thank you, Mr. Donovan. I believe that... Sit down and just shut the fuck up! I did a lot of terrible shit over there. In the name of this country. Shit that will haunt me for the rest of my life. But I did it because I believed in the fight. I believed what this nation stood for. So, to be sitting there ass deep in mud with that old woman scattered all around me and hearing that the president of the United States had just been fucking murdered, well, I knew right then and there that I couldn't let that stand. That I would find a way to make it right no matter how long it took. What are you saying? I'm saying that Sal Marcano and a group of conspirators murdered Jack Kennedy. Oh, that is the most absurd thing I have ever heard. I assume you no! say that. Don't fucking move! This... You're out of your mind. Oh, if you... I don't hold anyone's ambitions against them, Senator. And you certainly were ambitious, weren't you? You went to law school, and then you became a district attorney, and then the United States Senate. After Sal Marcano died, I went through his files. Imagine my surprise when I saw your name over and over and over and over again! The mob wanted Jack Kennedy dead, and you were more than willing to help. But there were cameras everywhere. There's witnesses. No, I want you them never to get see away with this, stupid asshole. No. Because then they will know that I am not finishing with you. I am starting with you. No. 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 Oh. 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 And they're next. <laughs> Gentlemen, Get God, you
mean to pry. Will you mind telling me who just flew off with the nuke? Oh, that's Gary. He's a great guy. You'd love him. Oh, Gary. Who the fuck is Gary? <laughs> He's a man who knows people. He'll probably even manage to squeeze a reward out of the Pentagon. Oh, don't worry. I'll cut you in. <laughs> oh, god damn. I'm famished. Hey, how about we stop for some shrimp po' boys? Ugh, I'll pass. What's the matter? Your weak-ass constitution can't handle some stick-to-your-ribs grub? That shit's practically a culinary disembowelment. <laughs> okay. How about we stop for some ice cream before I go talk to Marshall? Oh, ice cream? Who the fuck am I, your girlfriend? Hey, man. Dress fit. <laughs> fuck you! <laughs> yeah, sure, now he's got a sense of humor. <laughs>